Hey guys, Raj Sanger of Car Ridge Security. Welcome back to the channel and welcome to another Cars and Coffee event here at CAS HQ. Today's event has been organized by SSCC UK uh, and we have got a cool mix of cars. Lovely vibe here as well. Bhangra music playing in the background. Um, loads of amazing cars in the car park. You know the drill. We'll walk around, show you some of the cars, maybe grab two or three owners, talk about their cars and their journey. Right. I've got my coffee. Let's show you some of the cars. Now guys, as I was saying, proper mix of cars here today. Just look over my shoulder. SVJ, amazing yellow, and just check out that plate, Y6, the, the plate in itself is worth a few quid. On this side, we've got a Ferrari California, we've got some Porsches, we've got a Merc R129, there's a BM Alpina 5 Series hiding in the corner. But look, when was the last time you saw Plymouth Prowler? Come check this out. Lovely GTR. Check this out. How often do you see one of these, eh? Absolutely stock, lovely color. One car that I walked past that probably didn't show you in the clip is this amazing Resto mod. Uh, based on an early 911, 911 Carrera. Um, Bob, the owner, uh, known very well. He's got a body shop locally to us in Slough and he has created and designed this automotive art. I think that's the way to put it. This is automotive art. Um, so we'll get him on the channel. Where is he hiding? In fact, he's over here. We'll get him on the channel and he'll explain the whole journey of getting the car to look like this, because it does look absolutely amazing. Thanks for coming, Bob. Hey, Rods. Thanks. Uh, you've obviously bought the weather with you today, haven't you? Because yeah. it is absolutely amazing. Just to give you an idea, it's probably close to 30 degrees and it's 11.30 in the morning, so it is super hot. Now, tell me the story behind this car. I know you briefly told me off camera. How did you buy this car and how did you come to get hold of this car? So, um, I bought this car two years ago. Okay. Um, it was bought from a Porsche specialist, but the car was involved in an engine fire. So the back half of this car was pretty much burnt to a crisp. Didn't exist? Didn't exist. So yeah, Bob owns Auto Body Technique, which is local to us in Slough, and he works on cars. So he knows a little bit about paint and fab work and so on. So for him, this was like a no brainer. So you've taken it back to bare metal, stripped so, the paint. Yep, yeah, the car was stripped down to a shell. We've gone for light and con rods, uh, cranks. Um, so there's a lot of engine work gone into okay. it. So everything's steel on this. The okay. turbo wheel arches, so the whole body's based on turbo, turbo wheel arches, but then we've done our own fabrication. So yeah, put a sharper lines on the wheel arches to give it that more sort of 3-2 look as opposed sure. to a turbo look, but it's still as wide as a turbo. The colour? Colour's a 1960s Bentley colour called Pennine Grey. Certain lights, it's got that sort of olivey twist to it. So as a solid yeah. colour with no pearlescent, it's strange the way the colour fits. I've got to say, you've done a fantastic job. And looking around it earlier, you can see the fit and finish is absolutely brilliant. We've even gone down to the extent of painting the side uh, stripes on. Oh, they're painted, they're, they're not stickers. They're painted on, so you can feel them. Oh, they're nice. not, you can't even feel those. I thought they were so, stickers. Yeah, uh, so you can't even, you can't feel those. Whoa. But Bob's details are on the screen and in the description below. Make sure you give him a follow. If you've got any uh, work that you want to do, any rest of mods or just straightforward, uh, Accident repair, accident repair, paint work, insurance work, whatever, that kind of stuff. Uh, drop him a DM direct, obviously his details are there. Thank you for coming down. Lovely Thanks car. Thanks for having me here. I think at some point, when you are finished with it, we'll go out for a drive in this and we'll just do a, a separate episode dedicated to this car because I think it deserves it. It does look stunning and you guys know I'm a Porsche guy. So yeah, thanks for coming, Bob. No problem. Let's thanks, uh, Bob. carry on walking. Let's get hold of Bob, not Bob, Bob. Um, who's one of the organizers of SSCC UK. And uh, we'll have a chat with him. He's got his 997 here. So let's, let's find him and let's get him on the channel.
We've got hold of Bob and we are here with his 997 C4S. Hello mate. Hello Roger. So uh, Bob is the founder of SSCC UK. Always get it wrong, I say SSC UK, but it's actually <laughs> SSCC UK. Um, so you're the founder, so what is the club ethos? What is the club about? What made me create this was to create something that's family orientated. Sure. Um, generally, or the stigma is that guys go to car clubs and they leave their wives and children at home. Whereas this one, it's not bring, it's encouraging to bring your children and your wives, your parents, and, and you'll see that evident today as well. So let's let's talk a little bit about your car, 997 C4S. Yep. How long have you owned this? Uh, four years, four and a half years now. Fairly stock, is it? Yeah, it's stock apart from it's got the, the turbo uh, rear okay. and front aprons and uh, the rear deck. But uh, other than that, yeah, stock. And I'm sure you obviously love your Porsche as, yeah. uh, as I do. Yeah. Well, well done for organising the event uh, today. Great, well, not a problem. Great community here. Even Mr. Whippy's turned up as well to try and cash in. You know, in, that's Indians for you, obviously. car and coffee event we've had there where we've had Aston's rock up two of them they're fantastic I don't know much about Aston's but I do love what is this a vanquish guys what is this just drop a comment below that number plate's amazing as well I've asked him if he wants to sell it and it's a flat out no check this out guys 500 SEC now a couple of years ago you wouldn't actually see a 500 SEC on the road for some reason this year they're all coming out of the woodwork and this one's obviously uh, slammed on the floor. Lovely interior and just check out his uh, airlift controller. It's got his phone here, BT phone. Locked in place but and there's his airlift controller. Very, very, very clever. 993 Carrera 4S, Arena Red. Guys, you know I love my Porsches. This is just amazing. He's obviously detailed this because it just looks amazing in the sunlight. Uh, Pura Audi R8 and uh, our shop Mustang over here. And look, look at the guys just enjoying themselves. They had ice creams there, they had coffees, uh, they've had breakfast there. Proper chilled out vibe. But guess what? They're getting paid to stand there. Something I'm doing wrong or is it something they're doing right? Anyway, let's let's carry on walking. Something that caught my eye earlier on, apart from this amazing 190E, is this E34 B10 3.5 Alpina. And it is original because I've already asked the owner off camera. Dals, thanks oh, for coming. Are. Thank you. So what an amazing car, very rare as we all know. Yeah. So this is an original B10 3.5 Alpina. Rare colour as well because it's hell rot red. Okay. Which, if you look back, a lot of them were like dark blues, whites, greens, greys back in the day. And hell rot reds were more on the six series. Mm. And this is completely stock? Yeah. The, the, the only thing is we've, we've dropped it a little bit um, on Sports Springs, uh, 55 mil at the front and 35 at the back. Just to give it a little bit more of a yeah, it does it because the, the they, they sit quite high. Yeah, because they sit quite high. So um, I've had some sounds in it. Number plate I've had for many many years. Yeah, that's and a, it suits the era. So I thought it's a great number I'll, plate. <laughs> I'll put it on the car. Um, Lovely yeah, I condition. Just, I just love driving it. I just love driving it. I think, uh, and the, it's not just that, but you can have a new car, but when you got something so old. Hmm. You get people stopping, you say, oh, what is it? Oh, can I have a look? Can I have a photo? The police stopped me one day. And I thought, oh, my God, and I was speeding. They stopped so, me. so for those that don't know, he thought, that's it, I'm gone. That's the translation <laughs> right? of that. And then they stopped me and they started taking, taking we have photographs of the car. Oh, wow. Guys, 
What a great morning it's been. Fantastic turnout as always now. Um, just look at some of the cars behind me. Hurricane Performante, the Aventador, that Prowler is still absolutely amazing. Got to thank uh, Bob from SSCC UK for organizing the event. Uh, great turnout, amazing weather, lovely ice cream, amazing crowd too. Guys, thanks for watching. As always, any questions or comments you have, uh, drop them down below and we'll do our best to answer them. Um, we do get asked, even still now, when is your next event? Or where can I find out when the next event is? If you go to Car Discurity, the main website, cardiscurity.com, at the top, there's an events tab. Click on that and that will show you some of our previous events, including links to uh, YouTube videos and so on. And it'll show you the forthcoming events. Obviously guys, make sure you hit that like button, smash it now, uh, share and make sure you have subscribed to the channel so you know when the next event is and you know when the next video drops. I'll see you again soon on the next one.